everyone. So it is day, day four, no, day five of the Vlogtober, I think. I've lost count, but anyway. Um, so this morning I'm going to baby group, as you can hear, how since I woke up. Uh, we're going, well, it's not really baby group. We're like toddler group. Um, and they like use musical, musical instruments. Um, we sing on to kids songs like um, That Wheels on the Bus. That's an example. Um, then I'm going to come home. Harrison might have a nap by then. Um, depends what if he's tired or not. Might make some cookies today for when Grandma and Grandpa get back. <coughs> and Harrison can do it together. Um, don't know what else, but yeah. That's one I've got to make sure that the house is semi tidy so the cleaner can clean it. So yeah, let's just get into today's Vlogtober. I just made Harrison some breakfast. I just made some scrambled egg. Normally I give taste of it, but all of our bread has gone moldy. Disgusting. So that's what I've done him for breakfast some scrambled egg, and I'll give him a yogurt afterwards. So yeah, and we're going to baby group this morning, so we need to leave about 9.20 because it starts at 10 and then it finishes at 10.40, I think it is. So yeah, uh, I keep saying baby group, but they're not babies. They're all walking around apart from Harrison. Um, but he's getting there with help, so yeah. So he's just going to sit and eat his breakfast while I do a bit of tidying fun majority of the tidying up i just need to go and get dressed get harrison dressed and leave leave in 20 minutes so yeah that's a bit of a struggle but i'm sure we can do it so yeah i'm gonna go and get dressed now Hey, so sorry about the angle again, uh, but I just finished at toddler group and I am just on my way home now. I've been to Tesco afterwards um, just to get some ingredients for tonight because I'm cooking dinner tonight. Uh, like I said earlier, I'm doing like a, it's called an upside down, upside down fish pie. So the mashed potato goes at the bottom and then all the fish goes on the top rather than the fish and then the potato on the top. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing tonight. Um, I might also do some cookies later. Either I'll do it when we get back. While Harrison's awake before he has his afternoon nap. Or I'll do it after he's had his nap. So yeah, and I might cook myself some pasta. I might do my pasta sauce that I always do. So yeah. So that's what my plan is for today. I might take them to the park later, I don't know. And I don't know what time my parents will be back. But yeah. Don't know what I'll say. But yeah, I'm gonna walk home now and I'll see you guys when I get home. I am now home. Um I need to sort the washing out in the washing machine. I'm gonna put it on the line. Uh but I'll do my lunch first because obviously I want to do that while Harrison's asleep. Um, I've just managed to transfer him from the pram to his bed, which is good. Um, and I put all the ingredients in the fridge. Um, yeah. And I'll show you like what ingredients is in my pasta and then I'll do like a speedy video of me making it. I'll show you the ingredients that are in my pasta. I've added a few bits that I don't normally add to it, but I thought need to eat it so a pe chopped up pepper chopped up carrot one garlic an onion i've got this massive thing from costco which is sun-dried tomatoes well semi-dried tomatoes apparently 
uh, I'm going to add some of those to it. Normally I don't, we don't have those in the house, but they need to eat it. I've got this sauce that's left over, so I thought I'd add it to, to it. It's tomato and basil sauce. So I'll add that to it. I usually add chopped tomatoes. And I'm going to put some ham in it as well, just to add some meat to it. But yeah, that's what I add to it, and then obviously pasta. So yeah, I'm going to start cooking it. So I have just had lunch, I need to go and clear up, put the wash and stuff on the line, um, clean up Harrison's lunch, he didn't eat much of it, and then we're gonna make some cookies. It is already a made up mixed drink, just add water to it and just mix it. I know that's lazy, but it's just easier with a little one, you can have a go at stirring it. But yeah, so let's just go and get those things done. Uh, I didn't touch my room, but I'll probably do that tonight when he's asleep. Because it's easier, because I can't really do it when he's awake. So yeah, I'm going to go and clear away. I am going to set up to do the cookies. I will clean up after making the cookies, because obviously that will make a mess as well. So yeah, I'm going to bring his high chair in here, or his table and chair in here, and then we can go well, into the kitchen and we can do it in the kitchen. So it says, let me find it, so this is chocolate chip cookies, and it says, stir the cookie mixed together with water until you have a stiff dough, spoon heaped teaspoons, of the dough onto an ungreased, ungreased, ungreased bacon tray, leaving generous gaps between them. If you want chunky deli style cookies, and make your scoops or dough bigger, then you've got to bake for 10 to 12 minutes. Okay, how much water do I need? Uh, there you go, 30 mils of water. Okay, well, I'm going to bring his table in here. One second. Should we stir it together? You ready? You, you give it a go then. You ready? That's it, good boy. Can I need it? No, you can't eat this. No, you can't eat this. Right, grab. Some more water. Have to keep adding water until it forms a dough. Here we should be adding some more water. Yeah. Come on then. That's it, look. Give it a go then. Go on, you do it. That's it, good boy. Should we add a tiny bit more water? Just a tiny bit though. You ready? Quite, it's quite stiff, isn't it? 
Okay. Give it a stir. Go on then, give it a stir. Mummy, hold the bowl. That's it, good boy. <laughs> you can try it if you want. Look. Pass it here, Harrison. We need to turn the oven on. Okay. The cookies are all made. They're just on the drying rack. Drying, not drying, cooling down. Um, so yeah, and then obviously more parents get home later. Harrison will be re reunited with them because he hasn't seen them for about 10 days. Um, also it's bath night tonight. Harrison and me <laughs> so yeah I don't know what else I just change his nappy I also need to get the put the stuff on the line as well I haven't done that yet um, so yeah I haven't heard anything from my parents yet so I don't know if they've landed in the UK yet or not so yeah cookies look like a chocolate chip I'm just waiting for them to cool down and then I can split one with Harrison but yeah look really good um can't wait to try them right taste test mm. oh good Okay. Parents are now back. I'm just preparing, just making dinner. Um, I do like a speed video of me doing it. Um, I'm doing like an upside down fish pie. So yeah. That is getting there. I've cut up all the salmon and then I've got prawns there. And what I need to do is, once my dad's back from the shop, so I've got to get tartar sauce. But I add tartar sauce to that with the potato, mix it in. And I kind of squish the potato around the edge to form like a pastry, like looking. And then you put it in the oven for 10 minutes, I think it is. Or was it 15? Just double check. Oh no, 20 minutes, I was wrong. To put it in for 20 minutes until it's like gone golden take it out add the broccoli in the bottom it says and then you add the uh, broccoli oh arrange the blanche on top of it and then you add the dress uh, the salmon the prawns and tomatoes and then turn to oven for 10 minutes and then it's done so yeah so Harrison is now asleep. I am just gonna clear, clean my, tidy my room a bit, and go to bed. So, um, I'll see you. Not the following day, but the day after that, because Connor is posting t tomorrow's vlog. So yeah, bye. <laughs>